Hey YouTube, this is Robert from Sherburn Outdoors. Today we'll be reviewing the Ryobi 18 volt spreader. Um, if you like this kind of content on product reviews, go ahead and make sure to subscribe, click the like button, and don't forget to hit the bell for new content. Let's get started. Hey YouTube, this is Robert from Sherburn Outdoors. Hey, today we'll be reviewing the Ryobi 18 volt uh, spreader that you, it's a handheld you move around. It's about four and a half pounds. It holds about a gallon of material. Uh, I had a hand spreader that you went all over the yard. I've had it for like 15 years. It finally broke. I realized after a while that, uh, you know, it was killing my arm holding it and then doing this because I have a decent sized yard. So in this one, we're going to do a, an official unboxing of this and then we'll put some uh, grass seed and kind of roam around the yard with it a little bit. It does use the Ryobi 18 volt uh, one tool pack uh, that goes with it. So I have a ton, ton of these batteries laying around. We'll do it with a four amp hour. So let's go ahead and get started. So you can't, I couldn't find these in the store and it came uh, kind of in a very plain box with a label on it. So I thought we'd just kind of unbox it from the start. Just put it here. Let's just kind of open her up. It was a little bit odd. It, uh, it's the first time I bought a Ryobi product and it just, just kind of comes as a Ryobi product. Pretty simple, nothing major, no, no frills. Just a little bit of documentation in the, the box. Um, pretty simple. So this is our unit. Um, it's pretty light, weighs 4.25 pounds on the website, holds a gallon inside the reservoir here, and it really doesn't do a lot. It's got a, a button here that will actually open up the, the gate door in the bottom here, I'll show in just a second. It's got a knob here to select what your setting is going to be from zero to five and based upon this it will open up the uh, door a little bit further um, it's got your battery pack area back here and then it does have the ability to kind of put a little guide here along the way so that if you're going next to a, uh, a bed or something you can open it up and either go wide open at a full 180 or you can kind of reduce it down a little bit so you uh, you narrow your spread one of the other reasons I like this a lot is is I do have some areas close to the, the road and I find I just spray it everywhere, but holding it as we move through and being able to go down low with it versus having to do this, I found to be very advantageous. So I tell you what, let's, uh, let's actually put a battery in it really quick. So we are going to go with a, I've got a four amp lithium, 18 volt. This is pretty new. Um, we are set at a full battery pack here. Um, so we are ready to go. So let's just kind of plug this in and just look at the uh, the technology. I mean, it's very, very simple. So if we look in the bottom here, we have this thing that turns around and moves the product. And you just kind of press the button and it moves. And the door at the bottom opens up as you pull this in a little bit farther. Now I've got the door pretty, pretty shallow at zero. Let's kind of open it up wide open to five, which is pretty deep. So if we look inside of here, it opens all the way up. And so that's kind of the product as a whole. I tell you what, so let's, let's go get some grass seed and let's put inside of here. All right, we're gonna keep this pretty simple. We got some grass seed here and we're just gonna put it inside of here. We're gonna put it on about a three and then I'll, I'll, I'll move the uh, GoPro to a handheld and we'll just kind of walk around the yard and look at it real quick. So I plan on using this entire bag, so I'm just gonna cut it open so we get a nice dig. Got a good reservoir here. Just gonna go ahead and fill it up for the product. Looks like I'll get about two fills out of this bag. All right, so we can see here we are now full up. Let's go ahead and get handheld and let's start moving around. All right, YouTube, we got this ready to go now. I'm going to go down to a five, a three on my setting here. We're set at a five. So we're just going to back this down a little bit to a three. And uh, just really press the button. And we're starting to see. You see, I've got a nice 90 degree pattern going here because I've got the door on. So if I come here and open this up a little bit, on the side here, just kind of crank this down to where it's wide open now, like so. We'll get a much, much wider pattern. And it's so nice. Oh, I love this. You can just kind of go around, kind of does a nice, even, good spread around the yard. So we're going to do this entire backyard right now. So maybe I'll put this on a quick time loop and uh, just kind of, kind of walk around the backyard and see how it looks. All right, you 
YouTube. If you look down here, look at that spread on how well this stuff is laid out. So this is an area where my dogs actually pee on the ground a lot. And I just kind of use that spreader and I just did the entire yard from one side to the other. It took like five minutes. Something that used to take really long time. Um, now it's super simple. So this is the Ryobi 18 volt. I paid about 59 bucks for it with free delivery. Showed up in one day. Uh, use a standard 18 volts. Um, we didn't even use a nick off, off of our battery. Still at a full charge. So again, this is the Ryobi 18 volt spreader. Highly recommend it, love it. Super simple, just kick it and go. And uh, you can spread whatever and you got five different settings that you can do for how much the door opens so that you can release. Again, if you like these kind of videos on product reviews, go ahead and click the subscribe. Make sure you hit the like button and don't forget to hit that bell for new comment, uh, new content. Everybody have a great day. Thanks a lot.